I've got another relationship pitfall, a foible, a mistake that could be made for you to avoid. This is particularly important if you're getting into a new relationship. You've started to started to get a little close with somebody. A little spark? Yeah. Maybe you, spurring. Yes. You might be a few dates in. You want to make sure you don't PMI. PMI? PMI. Is that some sort of personal message? PMI stands for pre-mature intimacy. Mm, they're telling you to wait a little longer, huh? Yeah. Uh, but PMI, you're, you, many people think of intimacy and you think only, or the first thing that hops to mind anyways is physical. And of course you do want to postpone that. You don't want to jump into that prematurely, but it's not just that. Premature intimacy also means, you know, like uh, sharing intimate thoughts, feelings. Basically, you don't want to scare the other person, potentially scare the other person away by going too fast, saying, obviously, mm. like the big thing would be saying, I love you too quickly. But Pumping just, the brakes. Yeah. You can't. We, we've said this before. We, there just wasn't a term for doing the wrong thing. But we've said before, you don't want, you want to, you got to withhold some things. A little mysterious. Yeah. Uh, but now it's not just, it's not just us saying this. Uh, it's a relationship practitioner, Georgia Grace, also chiming in on this. PMI, premature intimacy. It's, it's similar because some people might think of the abbreviation TMI, too much information. They're very closely related. I think in this instance as well, one of the most important things mm -hmm. off the rip is you, you just can't be too, uh, too, seem too interested right away. Like if you're giving them like your whole rundown of your entire life, yeah, all your intimate thoughts about them, they're going to get scared off. You can't act like this is the first girl that you've ever seen that's ever thought that you were cute mm -hmm. or else she's going to think that you might be a little bit, a little bit clingy. That's right. Moving too quick, too soon. Who do you think is more likely to engage in PMI in a mm, relationship? This is tough. I think this is very intimacy. situational. You think so? It could I think man it could or be woman either. either way. Man or woman, yeah. I, I think it could go either way. Depending on the style in which the man or woman, or and also like a lot of things they're thinking. Sometimes people are too ready for a relationship. Yeah, Sometimes exactly Sometimes people right. really want a boyfriend or they really want a girlfriend. Mm -hmm. And so if you want it too bad... That is not going to shine through in a good light. Then you're, see, what can happen with PMI, pre premature intimacy, is that you're right. You're too excited, and so you want to speed things along. And one, like, subconscious, I think it's, it's not intentional, but a subconscious thing is like, well, if I tell them, like, really personal stuff. They're going to like me even more. Yeah, then, like, that'll really draw us closer together because they know so much about me. But that's actually, like, again, some of that personal stuff, you gotta. You definitely sh eventually should let them know, but that has to be at the right time in you the relationship. Yeah, play it cool. That's right. If you want it too bad, it's always if you want a boyfriend or girlfriend too much, you're gonna scare the other person off. Yep. This Every single to, time. This has happened to me. You wanted it too bad. I'm uh, not surprised. Yeah, that's right. You seem like the type. Especially, I think I, uh, it, for me, it was kind of a little bit of a rebound situation. Oh no. Yeah, that's what can happen. So what about with Angela? Were you were you cool? Cool, calm, and collected. Apparently. I can't be too sure. Yeah. I don't know. Don't ask her. Wasn't that a great Riot clip? While you're here, you should watch more of our videos and subscribe so you don't miss what we do next.